Hello, welcome to Easy Eatery. My name is Angela, and today we're gonna to check out this bacon that we're gonna make in the air fryer. I wanted to see the difference between regular bacon and the spiral one that I've been seeing all over the place, especially all over TikTok. So let's go check it out and see what the difference is. So I had five pieces of bacon, so we're gonna do three of them the regular way and two of them the spiral way. So basically, I'm just gonna lay those all out. And then the last two, I'm gonna twist up just like we see all over TikTok. And I see this all over the place, Google, everywhere. Everybody's trying this one out. And a lot of people like it. So I wanted to see what the difference was in cooking time and everything like that. So just gonna go ahead and twist that all up and stick that on there and uh, grab the other one, my last one. It's my last piece of bacon. I hope I don't mess it up because you know, these things are like golden right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that one on there. And I figured, you know what? Everything's gonna be touching. I better start switching things around just a little bit just to make it not touch. <laughs> so anyway, gonna go ahead and put those in our air fryer and I'm gonna use my uh, my uh, Power XL um, air fryer oven. I love this thing. Drop my temperature down to 350 degrees and we're gonna try it out for eight minutes. After eight minutes, this is what they're gonna look like. As you can see, the spiral ones are kind of sticking a little bit. And um, let's try the other ones. Now, I, this is how I always make my bacon, just the regular flat way. But um, I think, um, I don't know. We're just gonna go ahead. Okay, you know what? That's not done enough for me. I'm gonna put those spiral ones back on for four minutes. Four minutes later, this is what they look like. So in all fairness, I know that the other ones have been already sitting around for four minutes and they're nice and hard and they're crunchy. So we'll just go ahead and let those spiral ones settle down for just a couple minutes and we'll come back and take a look and see if anything has changed. Okay, after sitting around for a couple minutes, okay, see how the flat ones are nice and hard? Now, it didn't really turn out that way for the spiral ones, but of course, this is your preference. Um, but I just wanted to kind of see the difference. Now, I probably won't be doing the spiral ones again, um, unless I need some um, space savers. If I'm making a great big huge batch of them or something that'd be convenient. Listen to the crunch on this one, okay? It's nice and good. I mean, you can totally hear it. Now let's listen to the crunch on this one. Can't really hear anything. So they're, it, they're just not crunchy. Anyway, it just depends on your preference. Um, both cooked all the way through. The other ones, the spiral ones, take an additional four more minutes. Eight minutes versus 12. I don't know. To me, it seems like a no-brainer. But um, anyway, I just wanted to share that with you. So thank you so much for watching. And I will see you guys in the next one. Hey, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. And please give the video a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. See you soon. Bye-bye now.